Welcome back to another video. I was checking out the PTR, checking some stuff on the guild when I decided to just attack these things. I noticed my guild was leveling up. Now, when it first started, it was level one. I actually logged out, logged back in. It was level three. Turns out that I can just kill things and it levels up using the XP that I have in reserve. So upon killing these things, you'll see this little prompt pop up telling you that your guild has leveled up. I thought that was kind of cool and decided that I wanted to showcase this in a video just to kind of show you guys what it's going to do when your guild actually does level up. Now, this is going to be somewhat changed. I'm assuming there's going to be some kind of, you know, a little bit more bell and whistle to it. Possibly. Maybe not. Maybe it's going to stay semi-generic, but we'll have to wait and see. Either way, it's cool that just from killing these things, I'm able to level them up. I wish it would be that fast. No, not really. That'd be boring if it was that fast to level something up. It is because I have this, all this XP in reserve, and that's why I'm able to continuously rank. But I thought it'd be interesting to see what level I, my guild would be at. Okay, so I completed my farming and I got my guild to level 8. Now, at level 18, you're going to need 1.2 million XP to get to level 19. So, and goodness knows how much that's going to be, like 1.5 million to get to level 20. So, once you start getting to the higher numbers, you're going to really require a lot of XP to get up those levels. But I love this idea, the whole guild leveling thing. That is going to be really, really cool. This is the Hollow Edge Guild. So this is at level one, and you can see what you're going to need. This is something I want to show you. So when you're starting off at level one, brand new guild, you are going to need 7,000 XP to get to level two. So that's how easy it is to start off leveling your guilds. So now at level three, now I, I tried to do it at level two, but unfortunately during my run in the dungeon, I leveled it up twice, which is staggering because there's no way that I gained that much XP. I mean, to go from level one to level two needed 7,000. There's no way that in that amount of time I could have gotten that amount of XP just from running the one dungeon, but I went from level one up to level three. And now you can see right here. So this is 1,000, or sorry, 177,000 XP that I need to get to guild level four. But it, it just, it seems that the amount of XP that I was gaining for the runs that I was doing was incredibly high. Also, it doesn't instantaneously show you the difference, but you can see just how much it was really crazy. Actually, just from running that one dungeon, I don't understand how it could possibly have given me that much. It just, it seems really strange because I, I just ran this dungeon once and it gave me, it gave me that much XP to rank it up two times. So I, don't really get that, but, but anyways, so yeah, you can kind of see an example of how much this is going to spike, you know, starting from guild level one, guild level two is always going to be somewhere around 50 something thousand and then guild level three, which is going to be, I mean, it's 177,000. So it, it really ramps up there rather quickly. It's not going to be super easy to level your guilds depending on the amount of people you have and the amount of activity and whatnot. But currently I am not sure what it is qualifying. I mean, like I said, there's no way that I gained that amount of XP just from running that dungeon once they weren't giving me that good XP. So I'm really not sure what it was calculating for XP, but definitely gave me a vast portion far beyond what I was actually earning. The guild shop is now showing an item for me. I forgot to show this when I was on my main account, but it's odd because when I purchase it, it still doesn't do anything. And if it is doing anything, it doesn't show me that it's doing anything. There's no indicator down here or anywhere that shows me that it is active. So I'm not sure how it showcases. It's probably not functional right now, but it is interesting that it is actually visible. So you can see the cooldown is two minutes. The boost is a 50% XP boost to the guild. Now, this is not a 50% XP to you. It's to the guild. At least this is my assumption. 
and this is this is what it says it is so that's what i'm assuming it is and then the duration lasts for six hours so this costs a hundred tokens so definitely affordable not hard at all to get so you'll you won't have any problem obtaining this but i did want to mention that also wanted to mention this, Sean had asked, will the guild XP be rolled back to zero when the update goes live, or will the PTR displayed XP transfer over to the live? And Blaze said it will be reset, so you don't have to worry about what you're seeing on the PTR carrying over to the live servers. That will not happen. But that is it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and keep those swords swinging.